Hi everyone, I'm Jonathan Piper, manager of Artifacts and Exhibitions here at the Museum of Making Music. Today we're looking at a 1917 CG Con double bell euphonium. Two questions might come to mind. What's a euphonium? Why two bells? So starting with the euphonium question, a euphonium is a brass instrument that fits between the trumpet and the tuba in terms of range. It's kind of a mid-range brass instrument. Uh, what makes a euphonium not a baritone is the way that the tubing changes size uh, over the course of the instrument. So on a euphonium, which is called a conical bore instrument, the tubing will get progressively wider and wider and wider after the valves until it reaches what's called the bell flare here. On a cylindrical bore instrument like a trumpet, trombone, or baritone, uh, you're going to have a cylindrical bore which tends to be kind of like really close to the same size until right around the, the bell flare. The cylindrical bore is going to give you a really direct, kind of punchy or edgy sound, whereas the conical bore on a, on a euphonium, a tuba, a French horn, is going to give you a mellower sound. Uh, so it's just the way to get a, a different sound quality with the same pitch range. Now the second bell, we don't see too many new instruments being made with a second bell, but these were not uncommon uh, early in the 20th century and in the 19th century. And the second bell uh, is enabled by a valve over here. So if you were to push this valve down while playing, the sound would be rerouted out through that second bell. And what that's going to do is give the sound a kind of distant, uh, almost echoey sort of quality. So it's kind of like an early effect pedal uh, where you get a different sound quality built right into one instrument.